I said I would start the episode with a fire truck. Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. It's me, Zero the Unwise from Zero Plays Games. Get out of my fire truck. Get out of my fire truck. I have police on me now, but, uh, yeah, welcome back to Grand Theft Auto V. We're going to the garment factory in a fire truck, and the police see us. Let's just, let's be cops. I mean, let's be... Oh god, this is an immediately regrettable decision. Maybe not. That actually went a lot smoother than I thought it was. If you so much as nudge those gas pumps with a car, you will die. And everything around you will die. And I just took a fire truck through there. At speed, shit. That cop sees us. I thought I was free and clear, but no, 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 shit! I ain't got time for this crap right now. I'd rather never stop my vehicle. Ooh. Boink. We're turning on the sirens. We're going fast. We're going very, very fast through downtown. In a very, very big red truck. Right past the police. Whoop, we're taking out poles. We're flipping around. Wow, that was that was extremely quick. Alright. Uh, maybe if we go this way. Losing the police is so hard to do in this game. Oh! No. Damn, he saw me. Get your eyes off me, you perp, 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 vert. I think I have done it, guys. I think this. I think this is gonna get her done right here. Oh, ow! That tree hurt a lot. Watch it be like, oh, your fire truck is too damaged to use in the heist. And I had the nice little Porsche looking thing. Porsche Comet car. Fister. Fister Comet. And it's. It's all gone now. The guy just restored his like SUV. His Jeep looking thing, he's screaming at me that he just restored it. I don't know why you would restore a Jeep, but okay. I mean I could understand like an older TJ, but not what he was driving. No! 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 <laughs> Jesus! Wow. If that didn't just record a game clip, I don't know what did. Threading the needle on a fire truck. We're almost to the garment factory. Which is probably a good thing, because I don't know how much more of this crap my heart could take.
Yeah. One fire truck. How badly smashed up is it? Oh, dude, it's thrashed. Look at that. It's it's trashed. This thing's done for. There's bullet holes all up in the side of it and everything else. But we got flat tires and stuff now. Kitty! Kitty! Why are you so scared all the time? There's so many cats! Hey, Lester. We got a fire truck. It's parked around the back of your place. Good work. Call me when the rest of the prep's taken care of, okay? Kitty! <laughs> I'm not gonna... It's purring, guys. It's purring. I'm not gonna shoot it. Don't worry. I don't shoot pets. Other than accidentally. Like all the times I've shot pets in this game. And they usually get back up the first time. I mean, it is Grand Theft Auto, but it's not like abuse to animal simulator. Which, don't get me wrong, if there was an abuse to animal simulator, and I owned it, I would probably play the hell out of it. But this is Grand Theft Auto, so we're not going to abuse the animals. But we will Grand Theft Auto, you know what I mean? Oh crap, we still gotta find a damn... You know what, I need to find a heist car. Oh crap, she's calling the cops. Shit, she just called the cops. That guy just called the cops too. Time to go. OMG guys, it is time to go, because the cop shop was like right there, literally. Uh. Yeah. We're doing it and doing it and doing it well. Whoops. Seems like a burnout king. Let me go find a car that is suitable for the use in the getaway. Uh, how about this? Is it, what is this thing? An Ubermacht? Yeah. No, it's not. It's a like a Karen Astero. Might getaway location. Okay. No. Hide it in a discreet location. Oh. I have to hide this car discreetly. I don't even know where it needs to be. Uh, somewhere around maybe here ish. Yeah, we gotta go towards the FIB building. I'll park it next to May's Bank. May's Bank is close. Ah! So you're gonna drive into me? I think I totally did just drive into me too. Oh, hey, while we're here, while we're in the bad end of town, we need. Let's get a let's get a haircut. Michael needs to. What do you have he's, in mind? He's got his wife back, so he needs to trim himself up. He needs to clean himself up. The Lexington, clippered or grown out. Eh. I don't like any of those. What does he have for beards? Long stubbly beard. Yes. We'll go with a long stubbly beard. Oh good. You can get different haircuts from the different barbers around the town. His beard's all patchy and shit. I love it. I love it. Look at that. It's like 
Terrible. Thanks for stopping by. <clears throat> it's terribly bad. Let's call Franklin and just hide the car here. Franklin, Jimmy, Lester. Can I call Lester? Oh. Oh, it's on a road. Okay, that's why it can't be. It's got to be all discreet and shit. Alright. I'll park it discreetly. Gonna park my car discreetly. There we go. I would say that's a discreet spot to park my fucking car, wouldn't you, game? Too close to the agency building. Oh my god. Alright, let me go find a spot that's not too close to the agency building. I like this car! Look at that, Nicki Minaj is flipping me off, guys. Nicki Minaj! Why you flip me off, bitch? Huh? You wanna talk about it? Let me put away my phone, we talk about it. What you did to my car, woman. Look at my car now. Killer wheels, killer. I did kill her. That's even nicer ride. Oh crap. Oh, okay. I was about to say, am I am I hijacking a gangster ride? But obviously it is not. Police on me. Let's park it here at the car wash. We got super cop on us. This is a car wash. We'll just drive through it and get the car washed. And the police won't see us anymore. Can we not? We can't do the car wash? Shit. Hey, there's a clothing store over here. What is this? What is this? Discount store? Oh, hell yes. This is Bingo Clothing. This is the best store ever. Best store ever. Dude, you got cops on you. I don't anymore. Uh... We're gonna buy some polo shirts, dude. Michael is loaded. He's got more than a million dollars on him. We're just gonna buy all the things. I want not polo shirts. I want regular shirts. Yes. We're gonna buy it. I want the bowling shirts, and I know they have them, but they've got shorts. All yours. Enjoy. All good. We're buying all the things. Screw it. 
Comes with sandals too. Okay, we're all done, I think. Good choice. Michael, you're looking great. You're looking great, bro. Shirt. Uh, okay. Uh, what do we got over here? More shirts. We're done. Golf shirts. Cool. Um. Let's call in our getaway car location. Hey, Les, that getaway car is parked where we need it. All right, give me the location. Say it a little louder, douche. Strawberry. Then I guess we can't put it off any longer. I'll get word out to the guys. Come out to my office and speak to me. Cool. I want some shoes. No? Wow, look at us guys. We look we're so trim right now. There's other clothes in here that I want to buy. I must buy the It's not even giving me the option anymore. There we go. Maybe? Shirts. No, we just bought all those. Polo shirts. All yours. Briefs and socks. No. Sunglasses. Oh, yes. Lady, you look fucking anemic. Michael needs some, like, hipster douche glasses. And Something dark. like that. Some Skrillex shit. Can I get the uh, ladies' clothes? No? No? Polo shirts. No, I already own. I already own. Um, what can I? What else can we get? I wonder. Any accessories? No. No. We're good. We're good. We're 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 we're, we're stylish. No one will suspect the daytime stalker to steal cars and Come such. Come on, bro. Time to move. You devils just won't stop. I stole your car. All right. Well, we can go do this heist now. We have a fire truck. Let's do the let's do the FIB heist, and then we'll do the movie mission next episode. We're just gonna show up in this guy's non-cornering, non-steering car. The emergency brake is critical. It's a critical component to this car. Whoa! Kids always wear your seatbelt. Ow! Where did my car go? That was amazing. I went right through the windshield. I'm half dead, but I walked away from it unscathed for the most part. Actually, uh, I'm lying. I was plenty scathed in that one. I was very scathed. I came flying out of that car like a child being birthed. Let's come on up here and do hey, the heist. How you doing? Ah, pretty good under the circumstances. About to knock off a federal government building. Oh, meanwhile, my psychotic former <laughs> Look at BFF me. <laughs> is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. Franklin got us what we need. Put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. We have a toaster with newspaper and fire. Send a candle aren't going to do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. You will have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server 
and that the structure maintains its integrity. Oh wow, we're burning down the garbage so you get out, factory. Trigger the bombs. Meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call. And you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well, under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. Uh, Lester, are you going to be able to get out of there on time? Because I'm pretty sure the building's going to blow up very soon. We're going to go and mop the building. Mike, we doing this? Yeah, real soon, Frank. Pick up the fire truck and RV with Gus Moda and Daryl Johns. I'll give you word when I'm out of the bureau. I got it, dog. At least we can count on these guys in a pinch. We go up. We don't go down. We go up. Enter the FIB building and go to the turnstile. I'm packing so much heat. Guys, I'm packing so much heat. And my clothes clank, just like Franklin's. Ding, 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 ding. I don't know where the FIB building's doors are. I could swear that that's a door. But apparently it is not a door. Is this one a door? If you're yep. new, just clear your pass with security and you can go up. I'm totally new. Did you not just see me try to walk through the fucking window, you dumb bitch? Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. Uh, shut up, Michael. You're going to get us caught. I could see that happening, though, in the next GTA. By the way, GTA 6 is on the way. Uh, they're saying next year or really late this year. And I, could, I could see that. It's like, oh, you, you walked into the window instead of the door. Mission failed. You've drawn too much attention. Pick up the mop. Mission failed. You didn't know where the mop was. I've never mopped this floor. I've always just parachuted. Go to the office floor. <laughs> Mop the floor. Press button to drop the bucket. Oh god, it's viscera cleanup detail all over again. Da, 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 da. Press A to clean the floor with the mop. I'm cleaning the floor with the mop. Look at me cleaning, ah, guys. Dirty. The mop is dirty. Clean the mop in the... What? Left button cleans the mop. This is viscera cleanup detail. That's right, Michael. You whistle while you work because apparently when I do it, it's annoying. Plant the bomb. Yay! This I can do. Teeny tiny little fire bomb. There you go. Picking up the bucket, moving on. We're picking up the bucket, we're moving on. I should become a private contractor. At least then I'd be paid well to do menial work. 
Shut up, guy. You should become a contract hitman and thief. Then you get paid extravagantly to do extremely awesome work. What the frick? There's a dirty spot right there. I can see it. Do you not see that dirty spot, Michael? Come on, game. Got it. Aha. Da -da 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 -da. Mopping simulator is so fun. It's dirty my mop. favorite game ever. Cleaning the mop in the bucket. It's my favorite thing ever. Can I pick up the mop bucket too? I can. Look at that. La, 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 la. We're just going to take it on with us and set it down right here. Oh, I guess you get a clean mop every time you move the bucket, huh? Grab the bucket. Let's go. Let's do this shit faster. We only got 45 minutes for an episode, man. Do, 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 do. Looks like somebody's been pooping on the floor. Somebody's been taking a dump on the floor. Seriously, this is disgusting. It's dirty. Why does he have to announce to the world that the mop is dirty? You've drawn too much attention. You were talking to yourself on the job. No janitor goes, Oh, my mop is dirty. They just wring the damn mop out. I guess I just leave my mop while I go into the bathroom. Is Oh yeah, this is the restroom. Do, 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 you know you do, stay too late when the mopping dead show up. All right, all right, I'm leaving. Hmm. Yeah, this guy's making fun of my job. Can I tase his ass? It puts the mop in the bucket, and then it mops the floor with the mop that was in the bucket. To the closet. Where is this closet at? Oh god. Really? We gotta walk all the way around there? I guess we will just go. Another janitor? Was the last one a heart attack or a budget cut? Budget cut. When are you gonna get out of here? When I log my OT for the week. Man, it's not about being effective, it's about... I head home now, but I don't want to get stuck in the crop. It's time to do this. Elevator. Leave the building. Do 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 They don't work Going so hard. out the turnstile. We're all leaving in a minute. They're all leaving in a minute. Why? Why is everybody leaving in a minute? Time to get in my car. My car's gone. The hell? My car's gone. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Sits in motion, people. We ready to build. Y'all ready for this? In and out, oh, we're gonna pick up Michael. Oh, look, I see Michael. 
he runs so fast when he's not me. Let's not. All right, trigger the fire bombs, Frank. I'll get my turnout gear on. Oh look, detonate. I'm just gonna call up my buddy Detonate. He's the bomb. Kaboom. Now. Whoa! All right. We're first response. Let's go. Oh my gosh, guys! I heard an explosion. We better. Go investigate. So that's the hijacked emergency signal, right? Yep. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess. So don't worry. Pull it up there by the curb. All right, let's get in there. Fire department here. Never fear. Do I actually have to fight the fire? Elevators don't work in the case of fire. I'm surprised they don't have us running up 50 flights of stairs. All right, Lester says these elevators should still be fine. Was he on that industrial strip painkillers or that hallucinatory weed at the time? Yeah, probably a little bit of both. Cool, dog. Thanks for clearing that shit up. We gotta go across. Take the stairs to the top floor. All right, we're going across to the far stairwell and up to the top floor. I can't door to save my life this episode. Stairs are here. We take them up to 53. Not much 53. Let's push it. Oh wow, I have limited oxygen. I never would have guessed. 51 51 52 We're on the 53rd. The 53rd room is, is the one I blew up. Get the containment drive. Go. We're going for it. We're going to do it. F, the door's locked. Fit up on him. Blow it. It's hot. Look out. Removable drive in the server stack on the far wall. Removable stack. Got it. I've got a drive. Got drive. Let's go. We ain't got long. Follow me. It is time to go. The building is the building's coming down. It's time to go. The building's ready to cablode on us. It's time to go. What happens if I get all turned around? Uh oh. Building's coming down. Yeah, we're fucked now. Go, Franklin, go. Door's stuck. I gotta bust it down. Okay, ready now. Oh, Michael, no. We got some backdraft. John's is dead, man. Ah, oh, shit, man, he's dead. We can't think across through this inferno. Let's go. Oh, oh God. John's is dead. Hey, man, this shit is collapsing. We in trouble, dog. This way, this come on. Time to go. Oh, God, guys, this is scary. Holy shit. I could take these guys out, that's not a problem. Oh, 
There's a team of special agents. They know we're not firemen. Ooh, he had money. Eleven dollars. Up the rubble. Why are we going up? Should be an elevator shaft through here. Might be able to repel down it. Michael, how does he know this building so well? He's mopped it once. Bye guys. Here we go. We uh left to repel hold X to descend faster. Fuck it. I'm not gonna take all my get down here. We cool We got debris, shrapnel, and everything else falling at us. Almost got me. That thing almost got me too. The cutscene saved my life. Cutscene saved my life tonight. Yeah. Let's run! Leave the building and get into the fire truck. Oh my god. Down the stairs, up the stairs. Get all turned around. Around. Franklin is very slow. It's time to go. We got police and everybody else wondering why fire truck's leaving. Let's go. Where we stash the car? Come on. The police are probably like, why are the fire department leaving? We cannot be playing dress up when that happens. We need to get to the ride and torch this fire truck as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute they'll be looking for us. I mean, those guys at the building you took down. If they knew, who else is going to know? It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Trust me. I'm going to get us there as fast as I can. All right, shit. Shit, I just don't want to run into something. Man, y'all don't want to run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't want to run into. Haha, <laughs> you're right. So, uh, take us to our get out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. All right, man, I'll try. Try real hard, okay? I feel a whole lot better. Take us to Lester's. I blew up a fire truck. I, I, I blew up my fire truck. Michael's telling me to calm it down. Now we're clear, I can probably tell you people. I didn't think we were going to make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a dude, man. Oh, yeah, shit. I don't like speaking ill of the department, know what I'm saying? But that dude was in over his head. Yeah, he wasn't top draw, but I thought I didn't we expect that to so be the sound of Gus Moda there. Well, anyway, we made it out. So we got that to be thankful for. Daryl's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Hey, man, it was our fault Daryl went down. Really? Why's that? Didn't you speak to the guy? Nothing was his fault, so it, uh, it must have been us, right? Ah, uh, <laughs> I'll put it down to bad leadership then. I can tell you that because the leader was dumb enough to take you in there. True that. What's your problem? Hey, move, fool! I just ran hey, over a hooker. Up here. Hey now. 
I just ran over another hooker. That's two hookers dead. Cleaning up the streets. That's me. Keep your heads down, you hear? God damn, that guy sounds like a fucking <laughs> chipmunk. Well, Lester looks pissed. I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! Ah! Fucking A Ray, we oh. did it! Ah. Ow. How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission hmm. impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> <give some laughs> of Evil devious oh. laugh. Oh. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot <laughs> my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. I've got some real. Vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> Just a shit to make a man. No. Oh, exactly. Lester looks I happy to be committing incest. Drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm Ooh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> uh, Lester's funny as hell. Man, that's some foul ass shit. Oh. <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I got to go square things up with Davy and Dick Wild. For serious? Hey, I just want for them to serial? know that we did this oh thing God. for them. And we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, and we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I got to do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> incest <laughs> juice. Don't know how to put the mm. fun back in midlife crisis. Oh, look, Franklin pulls out a joint. Anyway, Franklin's gonna smoke up and Lester's gonna drink up and Michael's gonna just go see the FIB. No, we're calling Dave. We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly? It doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. Oh, They've been boy. sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck. Going to the court center. I will go to the court center. Where is that at? And how far? That's clear the fuck up there. Shit. I'll go in the next episode. We're just going to reminisce and feel good on the fact that we did a heist and we didn't make any real money for it. Yeah. Yeah, guys. We did a heist. We did a thing. Actually, this looks like a pretty good spot to end the episode, so I think that's uh, what I'm going to do. And I hope to see you in the next one. Alrighty? Bye-bye. Monster 2, they've got little... Oh, they're evil. Um... I don't know. Can I? Nope. Wow. This is, uh, different. And Big Brother's just kind of stuck there. Oh, oh, I see how it is. Big Brother can interact with it and pick the entire thing up. And Little Brother's just going to hang around for the ride. We're going to get up here and then come down here a little bit and keep away from these guys slow and steady wins the race ask anyone unless you're actually racing in which case uh, go fast go hard come in first place
Oh gosh, these guys are getting closer to me. These things are creepy. They're like trees that just want you to die. Alright, I don't see any of them up here. Oh, nope, there's one. Dang it! <laughs> dang it, dang it. Oh, dude, you need to save him right now. Come on. Swim, 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 swim. We have got to save our little brother. Interact with him. Get up. Get up to the top of the water. Come on. Don't let him drown. You're going to end up with pneumonia just like Dad. We need to teach him how to swim. We need to teach him how to swim at his earliest convenience. Or at our earliest convenience. What is this? This is a crazy...